Today, I want to talk about being in your head and Picasso. In this video, a while ago, I talked about the idea of being in your head. Okay, I want to add to that discussion today by talking about Picasso. Picasso had these three rules of art. One, learn all the rules. Two, practice until you can do it perfectly by the rules. Three, break all the rules or forget all the rules. All right, a lot of times students get frustrated because they're in that first and second stage and they haven't gotten to that third stage yet. When we're in that first and second stage, everything feels like it's on purpose and I'm making a decision for everything that I do. That's okay. I'm here to tell you that's okay. Give yourself a break. Have a little patience. Keep working those things because eventually every sort of conscious, on purpose thing that you're doing will eventually internalize and become automatic. Think about bowling or diving or throwing a javelin, any sort of sport that you're doing. At first, it's like, okay, step, 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 throw or step, 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 roll or step, step, jump, whatever. It's all sort of conscious and on purpose. But eventually, you practice it enough times, all the little sort of twists and tweaks and things that you're working on internalize and become natural. Think about when you learned the yes and, how unnatural that was at first, but eventually it became natural. Right? So usually students get frustrated in this first, second thing, and they're sort of like doing everything on purpose, but eventually those things will internalize and you can release and forget thinking about the rules. And you can break those rules on purpose and in, in a meaningful way that releases more power than it uses. Right? We, if we break a rule, which is totally part of the game, breaking rules, we just have to make sure that it makes a greater benefit than what it costs. And once we have internalized those rules and we're sort of stopped doing everything consciously or on purpose, but we're sort of more in the groove of it, then that's probably what we're going to be doing. Okay? So again, I invite you to give yourself a little break, have a little patience, keep working on those conscious activities until they internalize and become part of you. Um, and, and then you can forget about the rules and you'll do the quote unquote right thing automatically. Right? And that's really where we want to be in the zone just doing it right, just being in the moment and, and grooving with our partner, not thinking about rules or any of that jazz. Okay? Try it out this week. Have a little think about it. Let me know down below how you feel, and I'll see you next week. Hey, thanks for checking out the video. Please leave me a comment down below and tell me what you would like to hear an improv tip about. And also, please subscribe and follow me on Instagram, Twitter, and Facebook. All the links are in the description down below. Thanks.